Good morning, Sunrisers. I'm Dr. Karen Emerson, and today I have with me my technician, Mary Parker, and this is actually my own pet bearded dragon, Godzilla. And over here we have Jay, he's 11 year old, and this is his pet bearded dragon named Dasher. Dasher presented a few weeks ago, and he had been dragging his back right leg. So we talked to his parents and talked to Jay, and we found out that Dasher had a little bit of accident. Jay, can you tell us what happened? Oh, uh, well, I was cleaning up my tank, and then, you know, he was like sitting down on the floor. He was. He was either asleep, I think he was asleep under, um, well not under, but beside the pillow, and then I had accidentally moved the tank over and I had food on his leg. Yeah, so uh, uh, his food fell on him, or the top of the tank? The uh, food, the food. Yeah, the food. So it, it doesn't take a lot to break these guys' legs. So after he told me that, we went and did an x-ray of Dasher's back leg, and it was actually broken. So then we put Dasher under anesthesia, and we put a splint on his back leg. But it's really hard sometimes to, to have your reptile keep a splint on without getting it off because Dasher, what does Dasher eat? Um, Dasher eats crickets, mealworms, veggies. Um, so he has to chase his food. So it, it, Dasher really didn't like having the splint on the back leg and we really were having issues with getting the leg to heal. So we all talked about it and we decided to amputate Dasher's back leg. So as you can see, let's show him, show him on the camera right here. See, this is Dasher's... Uh, right back leg and as you can see that we amputated it right here but he gets along really really well he do, you really don't even know that he that he had it amputated he's, he's eating his food with no problem he's doing very well he did have some issues with his tail but we're getting that under control and he's growing so you know if you're if you do have a, a bearded dragon and you have him in an aquarium you always need to be careful when you're moving the top to not have any stuff sitting on it because it can fall and break their leg. But do you, don't you think Dasher's doing well with just three legs? You don't even hardly notice it anymore, do you? And in a little bit, we can show you the x-ray of actually what the leg looked like when it was broken. So if you have a bearded dragon and they've never seen a veterinarian, give us a call today. Let us set it up. We'll go through the husbandry for your bearded dragon and talk about what they need and what vet care they need. And I hope you guys have a great day. And remember, your pets will thank you. WCBI Animal Health with Dr. Emerson was brought to you by Emerson Animal Hospital in West Point.